Hey, it's Zero at Review Zone HD, and if I sound a little bit funny, it's because it is really late at night right now, so late that I'm not even going to tell you guys what time it is. What I'm showing to you tonight is my new logo, my new intro that I'm going to use for most of my videos, and this is actually what inspired me to do this type of logo. This is the Sniper Ghost Warrior loading screen, and I knew I wanted to do something with it, but I wasn't sure what I was going to do. This is actually something that I made in Microsoft Paint, and you know, just to explain, this is not a tutorial. I'm just showing you guys the step-by-step -step process in which I built this. But that's actually a film strip, as you can see right there. I doubled it up, and then I put my logos in the middle, and I threw in a white background behind it, so it'd give it kind of like a break in between them. I did that eight for like eight sets of those, so I had a total of you know eight different strips to use. I took those and I broke those into uh, two different groups of four and then I stacked them on top of each other and made them scroll up and down which is what I'm about to show you right here and this is what this basically was my basis for what I was gonna do I wasn't exactly sure what I was gonna do with it yet but I knew I was gonna do something that I thought was gonna turn out pretty cool and I think it did turn out pretty cool but right here uh, I took the one set of four and I put it on the top and I took the other set of four and I put it on the bottom and I'm going to show you guys what that looks like as well. Sorry that the Adobe After Effects photos look so crappy. I just uh, just kind of toss that together. But at this point, this is what I'm working with. And as you can see, there's a break in between them that I had to fix. So I put like a silver roller, I guess you'd say, in between it just to kind of break it apart. And then I took that Sniper Ghost Warrior loading screen. I put it behind there and I cut out the circle where the dude's head was and then I needed about 20 seconds of video to put in that circle so I just went back and grabbed some random footage from a few of my uh, more favorite things that I've recorded and I've had a friend that's been begging me to upload this right here this is uh, one of his shots that he made on his knees uh, his name's Skill Shooter and then right here is Rayman Origins I just kinda toss that in and then this is where I'm at at this point as you can see I got the uh, video behind in that circle and I also flipped that around and put it on the floor to give it kind of like a mirrored effect and this is what it looks like now. Now as you can see it's starting to actually look like something and that's pretty much what I was left with and then I just threw in some text and a couple other little things and that was pretty much a wrap and I like how it turned out. hope you guys like the new intro and I'm definitely going to bed. I think that I'll have some time to get some videos up tomorrow so hopefully I'll see you guys then.